I want to know what really happened when the Titans played the season opener at Miami in what turned out to be the longest game in NFL history, seven hours and eight minutes, yes. and you had the two long delays. Yes. Is the story true that someone or someone's from the ops staff went to the grocery store to get bread and peanut butter? True story. Okay. True story. We used to carry a trunk with us full of peanut butter and jelly. Okay. With all the bread in there typically, but when it happened, and I, I want to say, Mike, it was the second quarter started. Yeah. Uh, we started making PB&Js, and the guys were hungry, so they came in, and then they changed their sweat and socks, undershirts. We started making PB&Js. Even the general manager was helping make <laughs> And then the second break, we started making more PB&J, and then we ran out of bananas, and ran up on oranges, and then we went to half, more PB&Js, and then our post-game food came, which was a uh, Mission Barbecue. So next thing you know, in the third quarter, we're eating our post-game food. And then I get a call that we're out of bread and out of PB&Js, so I go to the concessionaire, and there's a friend of mine that works for Dolphins, helping me get two more loaves of bread. So at the end of the game, I was out of peanut butter, we were out of barbecue, we were out of everything. We're sitting there and everybody's about to lose their mind, as you probably heard as well. And the quarterback at the time, Marcus, said, I really just want a pepperoni pizza. So Luke Morrow on our staff, I gave him my credit card. He goes into the concourse and gets a pizza. So Marcus is eating pizza. I don't know, maybe that was the fourth quarter at that point. Okay. And then next thing you know, players see it. I want a pizza. Oh, wow. Here we go. So next thing you know, Luke's up there, and he takes a cooler, and he fills a cooler full of personal pizzas. Players eat pizza. I bet Chris and I handed out 7,000 cups of water on the side. I've never seen anything like it. I've never worked that hard in a 